Hey everybody, Tim Moore here with Tim Moore Outdoors, Old Town Canoes and Kayaks. It's an off afternoon for me, so I'm just doing a little bit of, of gear maintenance. And, you know, I'm pretty meticulous after um, an incident with my PDL one year where I was not very meticulous about maintenance on it, and I ended up breaking a prop pin on the water because it corroded and rusted. So now I am very, very meticulous about uh, maintenance on my on my PDL drives, especially after saltwater use, and I've had uh, saltwater charters the last two days, so I've been bringing them home and rinsing the drives off. And uh, this drive that I have here was rinsed yesterday and again today. When every time it's used, like I said, it was new this year, and I decided that I would check the lubrication that I put on it, the corrosion protection. And um, I was actually surprised after how well I take care of these drives to see uh, what I'm about to show you. I'm just going to flip the view around on the camera here real quick. So I ended the prop. What I use is a product called Fluid Film. It's good stuff. I use it on my trailers. I use it on everything. Um, so I took the, the nut in the washer off the pin, I mean off the prop, and I loosened it. Sometimes you got to give it a little bit of a whack to, to get it to break free, but not too hard. It doesn't take much. And that... If I can get the camera to focus, it is not substantial. I mean, the drive pin is still loose and free. See, the corrosion protection is is working pretty well, but there's already a little bit of rust on that, and some some rusty water here. It's a little bit of oil, and even on the back side of the prop, there's some rusty water in there. So I'm going to clean this up again. Like I said, this this drive was new this year so it hasn't had uh, you know several years worth of of use on it I'm gonna dry it up and I'm gonna recoat it with the fluid film um, but I also keep spare pins with me now you should receive two pins with your PDL uh, two spare pins in that accessory bag that has your your paddle holder and an Allen wrench and there should be a couple of pins in there. What I do is I take my pins so I can get them out of here. Keep them here. I have a small Ziploc bag. I've already done a video on this with two spins, there's an ex uh, two pins, there's an extra screw and that Allen wrench, but there's actually fluid film in that bag as well. So those are not gonna corrode while they're stored inside the storage so I'm gonna go ahead and get that cleaned up and relubricated and just wanted to share what it looks like with you guys and why it's important because I've actually had one of these pins rust and break on the water and if it rusts in there you can't get it to slide out so you can't really fix it on the water you need to actually punch that out and to loose it loosen it break it loose and replace the pin so it's a lot more difficult if it breaks on the water because of a rust failure or it can be so maintenance 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 these drives are amazing extremely well built probably the best drive on the market five-year warranty with them but they're still going to require that small amount of maintenance and you don't have to do it you can certainly let those pins rot out or do whatever you want but it's going to mean the difference for me between doing this in my driveway and doing this on the water